Hi Capricorn, welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading. Now let's continue, let's shuffle the deck four times for you. Let's see about the current energies first. Somebody here is uh, being very guarded. It feels like they have dropped the connection. There may have been hesitation now. It may be you or them, so take what resonates. And hesitating to give it another chance because viewing many red flags and uh, sometimes uh, criticizing oneself about why staying so long in that position in that connection when viewing so many problems. So lack of vulnerability to be more open and talk and communicate or trust again. Now let's see about what is affecting you in your subconscious that you may not be aware of. Is this, I see you in this reflection mode, thinking a lot, being withdrawn, uh, not very active, but trying to figure it all out, wanting to find more clarity. Can that connection be successful if there was a conversation? Could that conversation bring more clarity? I think you have been hurt emotionally a lot. You think a lot about the idea of exchanging a love message, but towards commitment you don't want to rush it because you are not sure. Let's see about the challenges of the past. A connection that could not be that stable, could not be serious, long term. Somebody may have feared commitment, didn't want to commit. It caused lots of pain and sorrow. And it may have been a repeated theme for some of you. And until there was this decision, enough is enough. And not wanting to stay in that gray area of uh, feeling low and not motivated and not happy and trying just to move on and uh, move forward and give up. How do you view the situation with them? You still have attraction, you sometimes want to build stability with them, something more grounded and structured. But you are being logical, you think a lot about how they may have been very mature in love and how they were not transparent and honest with you. And how that heavy it was as a relationship. Now let's see more details. That is your focus. More maturity, a more serious connection, more grounded stability. And you hope that you get more clarity by having a conversation with them. You want to hear the complete truth. It does not need to be a, an emotional conversation. It just need to have the facts and all the truths on the table. Now let's see about them. If you met them right now, what kind of message would they tell you? So what would happen if you met them right now? What would they tell you? Let's shuffle this deck four times. Let's see at the bottom, Eight of Pentacles, let's see what other cards, Ten of Cups, the Hermit, and Page of Swords. Page of Swords, Hermit, Ten of Cups, and the Eight of Pentacles at the bottom. They would tell you that they have kept watching you with some desire to talk one day, that they were very withdrawn, feeling alone, 
and they have thought a lot about working on that connection more, giving more energy, time. They try to use work or a hobby as a distraction from the past. Their big dream was to build something long-term and happy with you, but they couldn't open up because they didn't find that clarity. And they were just waiting for the chance to talk to you. They've been watching you from time to time with the intention to find the right moment to communicate. So that's the kind of message they would tell you if uh, you met them right now. Now I will continue this reading with more details in the extended where I will cover what kind of feelings do they have towards you at this moment, how do they view you from the outside, what are their intentions for now, what are the mutual energies and what are the energies around each one of you. If you want to watch the extended of this video, you can find it now in the description box below this video. Or if you are watching this on your mobile phone, you can just click the title, the description box will expand and at the top you can find the extended link. Thank you for watching, see you the next reading and bye for now.